Alright, so we're going to do some just break falls um, that you can do in your home. Should be pretty simple. Uh, no hard movements, not falling hard in your own living room. Should be able to do this on a little mat. So we're just going to fall backwards, rolling onto our back, just getting used to break falling. Uh, thing to remember to keep your head off the mat. And you're just going to disperse your energy and just kind of just touch the ground with the palms of your hands plus your body. So I'm just going to go back and here. Just rolling. I'm not letting my head touch. Just to do a couple of these. All right. So we'll do one more series like this, just warming up. Uh, this one we're going to do um, a bridge and then just a roll and kind of touch. So what I'm going to do is lay back. I'm going to go hips up. Hands are in still. I'm just going to reach and roll over and try and touch diagonally on the mat. Just here, hips up, roll, touch, go back, hips back down is fine, up, touch, and back. So I'll do it from the side, we're here, bridge up, reach and touch, back down, bridge up, reach and touch, back down. Good, Let's do 10 of those. All right, so we'll also do some shrimps, we're gonna do two leg shrimps and then single leg shrimp. That's it. So we're here laying on our back. I'll do it from this position. What I want to do is I just put my feet on either one side and then I'm just going to push, like roll on my side and push my bottom out trying to reach for my hands, uh, reaching for my feet. And then just pull myself back to center and then put your feet on the other side. Very slow. Just get all the way to your sides, reaching for your feet. Back to center. All right. From the side, same thing. Feet on the right side, just going to roll to my side and push my hips at the same time, nice and slow. Back to here, back to center. Feet on the other side, push your shoulder all the way over and back. Good. So do 10 of those. All right, last one will be the single leg shrimp, very much uh, similar to the first one. We're going to go here. I'm just going to drop one leg down. My other leg's just going to come over just like it did before, and I'm just going to shrimp. Like I have a dead leg here and I can't use it for anything. And I'll put it back and then switch. And then just make the adjustment. Again, reaching for my feet. Hips go back. So from the side, I'll go here, foot out. Again, I'm just getting to my side. Back. Other leg. And back. Just do 10 of those. Stepping 
up and out into a pseudo block. Seven. Again, eight. Nine. Spear thrust. Ten. Turning into a twin fist song suit. Eleven. Hammer fist. Twelve. Scoop. Thirteen. Turning toe song. Fourteen. High block, 15. Low block, 16. Stepping up, box block, 17. Stepping forward, box block, 18. 19. Step forward, lunge punch, 20. Turning into a side chop, side stance, 21. Again, 22. Again, 23. Step across the other way, 24. 25. Come on. Come on. Short. Sir. One more time. Jamaica. Jamaica. Stances and blocks. Turning into a low block. One. Two. High block. Two. Toes on. Three. Turning scoop block. Four. Hammer fist. Five. Song Su. Twin fist. Six. Stepping up and out into a pseudo block. Seven. Again. Eight. Nine. Spear thrust. Ten. Turning into a twin fist song Su. Eleven. Hammer fist. Twelve. Scoop. Thirteen. Turning toes on. 14. High block. 15. Low block. 16. Stepping up. Box block. 17. Stepping forward. Box block. 18. 19. Step forward. Lunge punch. 20. Turning into a side chop, side stance. 21. Again, 22. Again, 23. Step across the other way, 24. 25. Come on. Come on. Short. Sir. One more time. Jamaica. Jamaica. Stances and blocks. Turning into a low block. One. Two. High block. Two. Toes on. Three. Turning scoop block. Four. Hammer fist. Five. Song Su. Twin fist. Six. Stepping up and out into a pseudo block. Seven. Again. Eight. Nine. Spear thrust. Ten. Turning into a twin fist song Su. Eleven. Hammer fist, 12. Scoop, 13. Turning toes on, 14. High block, 15. Low block, 16. Stepping up, box block, 17. Stepping forward, box block, 18. 19. Step forward, lunge punch, 20. Turning into a side chop, side stance. 21. Again, 22. Again, 23. Step across the other way, 24. 25. Come on. Come on. Short. Sir. All right. So, uh, we're going to do a break fall um, to a technical stand up with the attacker kind of circling us. Uh, and then there's going to be a kind of a knee break kick that we're going to insert uh, as part of our stand up. Okay? So it looks like this. He pushes, breaks the ball here. He's going to circle. I just shooting, he goes the other way. Shooting when I'm ready. Then I go hips up, kick the knee, stand up, technical stand up this way. All right, we'll do it again. So I'm back. 
First of all, let me say that this numbering system comes from Lacoste, John Lacoste. So it is the Lacoste trolley system. There are many, many different numbering systems. So this is just it. And this is only one through five. So one, two, three, four, and five. Forehand diagonal, backhand diagonal, forehand horizontal, backhand horizontal, and a straight thrust. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay, so front bear grab, you grab one here. Just gonna get my underhooks here, and then I'm gonna go ahead and just stomp on the floor. Um, so I can do a few things here. I can just kind of dig in his ribs so he opens up. I wanna step back, then go into my elbow. Again, we're familiar with this. I can just pull him down and around, rear knee, hammer fist, and push him off. All right, so let's do it again from this side. Here, I can stomp, start digging in his ribs, open him up, elbow from this side. I can elbow here, I can knee, elbows, push them off, and I can mix these self-defense moves together. All right? So that'll be our front bear grab. Rear grab grab. Here. First things first I want to do is secure his hands to keep them from sliding up, and I'm going to stomp on his foot, and then I'm going to drop my hips down low. So here I'm about to shoot. I just want to shoot my bottom back and my hips forward at the same time. All right, if he hangs out there, then I can elbow to the ribs, to the ribs, to the head, groin shot as I step out and get away. We go up here, stomp, shoot. If he kind of starts to back up a little bit, I can just turn, side kick, and then I can get away and I don't have to worry about the rest of it. All right, so we'll go from this side. Here, stomp, drop, and shoot. Everything back and forward, side kick, and get out. All right, last one, shoulder grab self-defense, gets a good grip here. What I want to do is punch away from my attacker. If he's got a weak grip, then I'm going to be able to punch away and just get away. This is perfect, give him a key out, a key out and get your hands up. All right, so if he's got a good grip, he doesn't let go. I still want to throw that same punch, but it rolled my hip over. So side kick, huge circle here, trap. I want to elbow him, grab the back of the neck, get my underhook back. And then this is familiar, you got to pull down, knee to the face, hammer fist to the back of the neck, push him back. All right, so on this side, I punch away, side kick, circle, trap, elbow, under hook, and then again, knees, hammer fist really works the best here, push him back, key out. 